Hi, my name's Heather Plude. Uh, my, my whole family got sick from toxic mold in 2011. Uh, we remediated our house and threw out almost everything we owned and ripped the house down to studs. And it took 10 and a half months and my husband doing it himself uh, and $40,000 to remediate it. And we moved back in in February of 2012. We were living there right up in you know, through, you know, we still live there, but in August, I started getting sick again. So I did a mold test on my house. There's a mold test called the Hurts Me. Um, it's done through Mycometrics Lab. And anything over a 12, uh, somebody who's sick and sensitive like I am and my kids are, shouldn't be living in the house. So when we got the test back, it was a 20. And I knew we had to do something about it. So I started looking into the high-tech air machines. I had known about them for a couple of years, but I wasn't sick, so I didn't need them. We did the remediation. I didn't think I'd ever need them. But houses don't, uh, they can get moldy again. You know, I think ours was just cross-contamination. We never found a water leak. But what happened was I ordered a machine for myself, and my parents had been sick in their house and I knew it was moldy so I ordered one for them and when we put it in my house I tested I waited three months before I tested again but at the three month mark I tested the house the same way I had before and the test had gone from a 20 to a 6. I was feeling better within a week of putting the machines in my parents have one in their house they're feeling better in their house and now I can go visit my parents. They were, were sick in their house. They're not anymore. I don't get sick when I go over there anymore. Since then, I put these in my ex's house where my kids live so that I can make sure that when they're over there, they're safe too. Uh, we've done testing over there and it, the mold spore counts went down to almost nothing. Uh, one of the things that was really impressive to me was when we first did the test in there, it was a, it was a spore trap test, shows how much is in the air, and it showed an 80% coverage with five minutes of testing. The second time we did the same five minutes of testing, but it was down to 3% coverage. So it just really cleaned up the air over there, and I can go over there and not get sick. So to me, if if you can put one of these in a building and someone that's as sensitive as I am cannot get sick, then that means a heck of a lot. And, you know, it's, it's certainly changed my life, my perspective on mold. I used to think you had to throw everything out again. You know, I thought we were going to have to throw everything out again. And we were able to stay in our home and keep our things. And, uh, you know, it seems like life's back to normal. So I recommend getting a mold test if you're not feeling good. Find out if mold is your problem. If it is, get a high-tech air. Get the right one for your square footage of your house and do an after test after you run the, the high tech in your house and prove it to yourself. You know, it, when you get that after test and you see the mold counts go down, you'll know that you did the right thing.